Hello, my name is Jacob Lewis, and today I'm going to do a quick tutorial on creating interlocking designs, kind of like Celtic knots or woven shapes, that sort of thing. Anything where it's going to be 2D, but kind of have a, or one color and kind of have a weaving in and out of itself kind of appearance. So let me show you what I'm talking about. I'm just going to create a circle. And then I'm going to go down here, and then a shift click, and we're going to do 120 degrees, and then copy it, and copy it again. So we have three interlocking circles like so, with just a stroke, no fill. I'm going to thicken that up. Now I'm going to go to Object and Expand, and I'm going to expand the fill and the stroke. Actually, no. Before I do that, no, no, yeah, no, that's what I'm going to do. Object, Expand. Okay. So we have three circles that are just filled. Now I'm going to go to Object, and I'm going to go to path and offset path and then I turn on preview so you can see what that's doing is I have it set to 10 pixels so it's putting um, another duplicate path 10 pixels out from the center so you can play with those settings and get it to look just how you want I'm going to leave it at 10 and then hit OK so now you just want to select all of this, zoom in on it, and you can get your Shape Builder tool over here. And if you hold Option on the Mac and click on the outside, or click on shapes, it will remove them. Okay, didn't mean to do that. Undo. So yeah, if you hold Option and click and drag, you can remove shapes like so. And then you can just kind of weave it in and out by being aware of what you're doing. Okay, so we go over, under, and then we want to go over. So we're going to get rid of this side, over, okay, over, under, over, and then under. under. Over, under, over, under. So that's good. And then you just want to do that with all of them. So this is going to go, it's going under here, so now it's going to go over here. And this is going under and then we want it to go over great that's looking pretty good might have to clean up some of these points stragglers now we can go over here to the pathfinder and hit merge and that will just connect everything together if you select one of those straggler paths and then say select same appearance no not appearance select same no object stray points it'll select all your stray points so you can just delete them I guess there was just the one So yeah, that's basically 
all we're going to cover in this video. I hope you got something out of that. You can change the color of this to whatever you want. And you can do this to a lot of different things. So just experiment around and have fun. Thanks. Check out my portfolio at bluelotusmedia.com. And please like this video if you like it and subscribe for more. Thanks.